Western Australia is known for its beautiful, pristine waters and the seafood that we're able to enjoy out of it. I'm here today with one of my favourite chefs from Will Street in Leederville, Chef Will Merrick, to tell us all about the Akoya and how he cooks it. Now, the Akoya is grown uniquely in the world, only in WA for culinary purposes. Tell us what you do with this incredible seafood treasure. Well, it's a new thing for me, so it was great when I arrived back here to Perth to be able to use it and be able to put it on the menu. Tell us a bit about the dish that we're making. It's a buttermilk dressing with the chardonnay and some garlic in there. We've also got a coriander oil, and that's it. It's super Perfect. simple. Perfect, all right. And with a little bit of spice of chilli in there as well. So you take them from the top, and again, you can use a butter knife at home, which is really easy. Flip them open. You know, I've seen different ways of doing them. I've used them fresh. I find the best way to use them, really, is the blanche technique. All right, so we're going to get these blanched. Yeah. So 30 um, to 40 so, seconds. Yeah, about 30 seconds. 30 to 40 seconds is right. fine. And we'll just pop these into here. And then can you count for 40 seconds? I can. <laughs> you got it in your head? I can count backwards. You can count backwards. <laughs> give this a quick rinse and just give them a quick wash. Oh, that sounds nice. Ding ling. Good, ding ling ling. <laughs> How many are we now? We're at 10, 9, 8. We're ready to go, Will. Ready, ready, yeah. Pop them out and put them into the ice. Oh. Okay, so next thing is we're going to take some coriander. Now I blanch the coriander. Blanch very quickly, put in ice. Okay, now take that out and then pop it into there. I'm going to do some chilies. Are they going whole in? They go whole in. And we'll just grab some olive oil straight in there and pop that in. OK, so just turn that on, blend that through. OK, that should be it. And then we'll just strain that off. You, you really want this green to come out of it. Next step is the buttermilk dressing. I do with Chardonnay vinegar. Okay. So we'll go one vegan um, mayonnaise that we're using. So no eggs or anything in here. And then we'll go three buttermilk. One, two, three. How does this apply to a garlic knot? <laughs> no, the garlic, just do one. Yeah. So it's a one-to-one. -one. It's a one-to-one -one <laughs> on that one. And then we'll add in one of the Chardonnay. Vinegar. All right. OK, so while we're doing that, I'm going to get the acquires here and just pop them out. Nice and plump. And you can see the... Yeah, the tension's the, there. The tension's there, yeah. but they're not overcooked. They're not, they're not hard. I never get sick of looking at these shells. And then finally chop some chives on there. Super fine. Even finer than that. Finer, 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 I'm finer. I'm going to get a job at the end of this. Exactly. <laughs> Even finer, finer. Oh, so a little trick. Yes. Is basically get your knuckles and you've got to rub the knife down your knuckles. And then there we go. I'm lucky I don't have to type really on the computer glad you're too doing much. This bit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so do you want to maybe put a little bit of the buttermilk on each of the um, akoya? Use the finer little chives on there and sprinkle that on. And then I'm going to take some of this oil, I would say. Beautiful. Here are the akoyas with buttermilk and coriander uh, dressing and a little bit of chives. Right, let's have a try of these. Mm. Mm. Good, yeah. They really have such a unique taste profile and you really bring the flavours out oh, in only you. the way that you can. And you're serving these at Will Street now? Yep, we on are. On the menu? On the menu. They've been a signature from the beginning, so come try them. <laughs>